Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to three champs versus five of each rank. We're starting here on coastline with the copper players first. We've got our three champs here, Noodle, Uzi, and Ice Cold. Starting on attack here on coastline against our five coppers, Eclipse, Air, Taft, LA, and Blake. Thank you to all of these guys for playing. Thank you to Uzi, Ice Cold, and Noodle for playing in this video as well. The links to all of their socials will be in the description, so make sure to follow these guys on YouTube, Twitch, Twitter, whatever it may be that's down there in the description. Make sure to give them a follow, and let's move on to this first round. All right, so it looks like the Coppers decided to go Uka first. The upper lineup actually isn't that bad, all things considered. They're doubling up on the heal ops, which is uh, questionable. Definitely not the lineup you'd want to see in ranked, but... For copper players, I think this is about the best we're going to see it. Looking at the champ squad, we've got a Twitch on Noodle, Buck on Ice Cold, and Zof on Uzi. Now, I know Noodle, I was just in the Discord call with them, and Noodle was saying how they wanted to do pistols only the first round. So I think that's what they're doing. So obviously, they're a little bit confident in their abilities to win this round. And wow, the Capcom shooting that ADS, that is crazy. Uzi wants me to look. Oh no, here he goes. That's one kill already to Uzi. For some reason, the kill feed's not popping up, but that's going to be Uzi getting a nice headshot onto Blake. Noodle doing a lot of damage onto Eclipse. Actually going to take him out. For some reason, the kill feed is just not popping up, but that's two kills for the champ squad. Ice Cold looking to get a third for them. Going to do a lot of damage onto Enforce. Uzi just all the way in, getting another kill for the champ squad. Going for his third in the rounds. He's about to get it. Oh, the Thunderbird saved his life. The Thunderbird overhealed Path at just the right time, and he was able to tank that damage, but he is down. It's all up to Air, who is 1 HP, and on the other side of the map, he should have went in and rest his teammate. Not going to happen, though. Going to try to push around into the 90 hall, but Ice Cold is here, ready. Potentially, not going to happen. Air going to get the first kill for the Coppers, or actually, I guess technically the second kill. Noodle versus Air. Both of them are 1 HP. Twitch don't coming out. Narrowly missing the kill onto Air. Literally 1 HP. If Noodle had another zap on that Twitch zone, he definitely would have killed him with it. This looks like a guaranteed win for Noodle, but he's actually going to get down. This could... It's not impossible. It's not possible for the Coppers to win. The Coppers were actually able to kill all three champ players there, but they were using pistols only, so... Not a bad round from the Coppers, but definitely a dominant victory for the champs, all things considered. All right, we're definitely seeing some Copper strats coming out right now. Ile has got the Capkin, which is actually not a bad operator and could, in fact, catch the champ squad off guard. But the problem is he's running impact grenades, and I want to see... All right, yeah, so Blake is also running impact grenades. That's two C4s that the uh, Copper squad is not running, that they could be running. Wow, that's going to be Uzi with the kill on the Blake through the wall right there. An another kill. That is two pistol kills for Uzi already. Just seconds into the round, but that's going to be Air refragging him. Very nice shots by him. Noodle going to come for the refrag potentially. He knows that Air is inside of... Uh, sunrise, but not going to get anything with that. That's the C4 going out. So that's potentially one of their only C4s gone. Doodle narrowly missing the shots onto air, potentially actually tagging him up just a little bit. Ice cold. Where is ice cold? Blazing it up right now. Narrowly missing the shots on the Capkin. Trying to get to the quick B. Hits him twice. Hits him three times. That's the kill. 2v2 for the champ squad. Half an air versus Noodle and ice cold. Air trying to push in through downstairs. Noodle going to be joining this out, though. Definitely heard and saw him. Noodle going to try to push in off of this now, and Air is going to fall back. Probably a smart move, all things considered. Paft on camps right now. He really needs to get off and let his dead teammates sit on camps, though. Ice Cold going to try to push in through the smoke while Noodle repels onto the big window, and that's going to be Paft getting the first kill onto Noodle. Ice Cold going to refrag, though. Going to drop the hatch now. 1v1. Air versus Ice Cold. Ice Cold has no idea where he's at, but Air is actually so far off the site right now. A copper quick peeking. What am I seeing? This is insane. He's got to be careful of these Goyo traps. For some reason, he's checking cams when he's got four dead teammates to do that for him. Now, Air does have Thunderbirds. He could try to get healed right now. There's one right behind the bar, but he just walks right by it. What's the reasoning for it? I have no idea. 
Stop checking cams. Get off the cams. You have four teammates. Ice Cold is on the case, as he would say. He's got a pretty clear idea of where he's at. He's about to, this guy's about to get one tapped. Wow. And there's the win. Glass bearing nine. What a sight to be seen. Ladies and gentlemen, I just realized that I was playing on no HUD, and that was the reason behind not getting any sort of alerts when each player killed each other. So I apologize for that. I turned the HUD back on. Um, blame my thumbnail artist for making me go in and get the thumbnail. Normally he does it. I had to do it, and I forgot to turn my settings back to normal. It's like Noodle setting up a drone inside an office. Probably going to try to do some sort of a office take here. Most likely we'll either see one of the champ players sit on the drone for Noodle or he'll clear it himself. Probably going to make sure this room's clear. Sludge open that double door in office. We'll most likely see him spawn ruins. And he's probably going to try to take straight into blue bar quickly. But we just saw, I believe that was error, barricade that door. So he's going to have to have go through that. But probably no big deal. Actually, Noodle running the shotgun right now. Pretty ballsy strat considering the SMG-11 is gone. But uh, we all know how good Noodle's aim is. Probably won't matter too much to him. Gonna be checking that drone. Shotgun straight in. Using not to sledgehammer it. Melee hole's coming out. This could be a free kill for Noodle right now, actually. Shotgun through the wall. Kate is just stuck right now inside of this corner. He's gonna get downed by Noodle. Nice kill by him. First kill of the round already going to the champ squad here. 2-0 for them, by the way. Looks like they're doing a shotgun only round. Uzi just gonna fly straight in. Noodle trying to get a gunfight of his own. Not gonna, quite gonna get any kills though. This one's still in Sunrise. It's Air. Air is just all the way in Sunrise right now. They have no idea. Uzi running in sight and getting two kills. Nice shots by him. Air gonna get a kill of his own onto Noodle. All up to Air in the 1v3. He gets the first kill. Ice Cold gonna be planting the bomb. Uzi. What is Uzi doing? Gonna get the team kill and the other kill. Uzi's just too good with the shotgun. Nine and two, by the way. Scoreboard check. Nine and two for Uzi. Make it ten and two. He got the kill in ice cold. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the champ squad's first round on defense here on Coastline. And it could also be their last as they have match point. It's currently 3-0 for the champ squad. Hoppers have yet to get a single round. Looking at the scoreboard, we've got Air leading the copper team four and two. Right behind him, we've got Path going two and three. The rest of the Copper team, though, not a single kill. Now, it is fair to say that it's a lot more difficult for them to get kills, not only because they're significantly worse than these three champ players, but there's also only three people on the champ squad, whereas there's five on the Copper squad, so there's less kills to go around. It's easier for the champ squad to get more kills. So, can't look at that too much. Uzi leading the champ squad, though, nine and two. Very nice by him. That's going to be Noodle with pretty much an instant spawn peak. That is just tragic for air. That's going to be the top frag for the Copper squad down. Uzi all the way in spawn. Going to get two kills. How is he doing it? He's outside. Copper player shoot back. You have wall hacks. Uzi finally going to get taken out by Ile. Nice shots by him. Noodle going to run out this door. Going to get a kill onto Ile. And that is Ice Cold following it up with a kill on the Blake. That is a quick 4-0 for the champ squad. Hoppers did not stand a chance whatsoever. GG's to the Copper Squad, and we are going to be moving on to the Bronze Players. Uzi, you're going to get fucking ripped apart again in my comments. I know, bro. <laughs> listen, listen. Put this in the video. It is a joke. I'm sorry, guys. I don't think they care, bro. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are here with our three champs once again, starting on Oregon against five Bronze Players. For whatever reason, this guy's name is Best Copper, but if you look at his rank, he's he's actually bronze, so I, I'm not really sure what that's about. I guess he was copper, and then he ranked up, so whatever. Uh, anyways, they're going to be starting on defense, and our champ squad is once again starting on attack here on Oregon. Also, if you guys are enjoying this video, please consider liking the video. Let's get this video to 5k likes. That'd be pretty cool. Subscribe if you guys are new. And if you guys are already subscribed, consider turning notifications on as I post daily here on the channel. So if you don't want to miss out on future videos like this one, make sure you guys have notifications turned on. Also, if you would like to be one of these players in this lobby right now in a future video, consider joining my Discord server. The link is in the description. It's totally free. You both console and PC players. Whenever I'm doing a video like this, if you know, if you guys are like trying to figure out how to join, literally all I do is I add everyone in my Discord server 
and I just have people join from there. So if you guys want to play in one of these videos, just again, feel free to check out the Discord. It's free. Link is in the description. Uzi is begging you guys to be nice this time. He is scarred for life after that uh, five console players versus five PC players. He said he's reformed, so... All right, so it doesn't look like the champs are trying to do any specific strat this time. We saw last last game against the coppers, they were doing like pistols only and like shotguns only. This time, I mean, they got LMGs, they got lion. Looks like they're just going straight in. And it looks like Zap might be the first to die here to Noodle as Noodle is just sitting here waiting. It's actually going to be Uzi going to fall first to that alibi. Not before Noodle refragging though. All up to Ice Cold and Noodle in this 2v4. like Flemo might be the second victim of Noodle who is downstairs right now. Depends if Uzi or if Noodle knows. Noodle nearly missing the shots to the floor right there. That was almost crazy if he got the hit fire. I'm really worried about Flemo flanking Noodle here who is just on the top of this staircase. He's in such a good spot to flank right now. It's actually ridiculous. Where is Ice Cold at? Ice Cold is still playing in the big window. They're honestly not in that bad of a spot. Flemo is still on the flank here. That's going to be Stacy's mom getting another kill onto Ice Cold and Best Copper getting a C4 kill onto Noodle. Surprisingly, the first round of the three champs for his five bronze is going to go to the bronze players. Who would have thought? Unfortunately, Best Copper had just disconnected. We're going to keep the round going, so it's going to be a 3v4 for this round. Maybe not that bad of a thing considering the bronze players had actually taken the first round so maybe this is exactly what the champs needed maybe they needed just a little bit of a break here definitely can see the bronze shots coming out we've got barricades going on this door for some random reason double reinforcing elbow you can definitely tell that these are bronze players with that being said uzi flying in here from to be small tower and he might actually catch one of these players off guard it could be stacy right now Uzi does he hear him looking the wrong way Stacy with another kill currently leading and carrying the bronze team going three and zero so far in this matchup wow that's gonna be noodle flanking in from bunker two perfect kills look at the recoil control on that f2 absolutely flawless all up to ice cold and noodle once again in the 2v2 situation Stacy bomb and flemo the last two defenders on the bronze team but noodle so accurate with that f2 gonna get a third kill now it's all up to stacy's mom the carry for the bronze team it's noodle versus stacy's mom stacy's mom gonna pick up noodle it's all up to ice cold now and he's gonna pick it up that's stacy's mom going down oh my goodness and we get a w for stacy in the comments oh my god he is actually putting in some serious amount of work right now. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are back onto our attacking round with our champ players here. A bunch of drones getting instantly shot out from the champ team. Uh, bronze players able to shoot those drones instantly. We actually have Flemo going for a spawn peak. That is interesting. Uzi already pushed in pretty far here. Now, Flemo is very loud right above Uzi, and he's definitely going to hear that. Pre-fire coming out from Uzi, and that's Flemo going down. Noodle taking a little bit of damage and Ice Cold also already in. Gonna get a nice one tap onto uh, Stacy's mom with another kill on the Maddox. That's two for Ice Cold and looking for a third. Very nice, flawless round from the champ players. They lost that first round and it looks like they got all their momentum back now with these last two rounds. I'm drinking that sour blue chug rug right now, that uh, G Fuel flavor. You guys should check it out. Link in the description. Get 30% off. Use code SHOCK. Stuff is pretty fire. If you're looking for some like flavor recommendations, I definitely recommend uh, Blue Ice, Tropical Rain, and um, what was the other one? Phase Berry. Those three flavors are very good. So if you guys are interested in trying out some G Fuel, make sure to use my code, code SHOCK, get 30% off. Use the link in the description. Check out those three flavors. That's what I recommend the most. All right, this is going to be the champs. First round here on defense. They decided to go top floor. Lots of spawn peaks coming out. Uzi about to fly out the front door, the master door here. Looks like most of the bronze team is big window, which is not a surprise whatsoever. Normally in higher ranks, you just see everybody kind of gather around the big window and hold the exact same angle. Not really knowing what exactly to do. They've got a good lineup to go take master right now. They've got the ace. They could go open up the, the breach and master. But instead, they are all hanging around the master window. Ying's coming out. Ice Cold going to get a kill on the Flemo. That's the Ying dead. He's going to get 
blind, but it doesn't matter. Got the kill anyways. Is he coming over to try to contest the ace who is pushing in through faster? Wow, Stacy's mom just all the way up on a white star is getting taken out immediately by Noodle. Uzi with another kill as well. Nice refrag. Uzi all the way outside, gonna down the ace. Only one person left, and that is Zap who's actually crouched on white stairs right now. Ice Cold coming for the swing. Gonna do lots of damage and actually gonna take him out. Good round from the champ players, three to one. Lots of spot piece coming out here. Ice Cold just sitting here waiting for the team to push in. That's already one kill for Ice Cold. Maddox gonna refrag though. That is the Ash getting that kill with the G36. Finca going down. Gonna lose the smoke on the champ squad though, which is pretty, pretty, a uh, pretty big deal there, but since this is not going to be a traditional hold, probably not that big of a deal in this specific case here. Nay going to come out here from best copper, and that's going to land onto Noodle. It's all up to Uzi now in the 1v3, or the 1v4. Waiting for the players to push in from bunker. They're being very patient, though. They're actually playing this pretty smart. Daisy's mom all the way looking into dining. I'm not really sure what he's doing exactly. Uzi with the first kill onto best copper. Knows there's one coming on the stairs. That's another kill for Uzi. Looking for the third now. It's gonna that's gonna be Ash. One HP all the way in bunker right now. The freeze kill Uzi's life, and he's gonna get it. Last one, Stacy's mom inside a freezer. Uzi knows it. He hears him looking at the door. He's gonna win it. Stacy's mom or Uzi. Uzi swings, but Stacy's mom is gonna win it. Three to two for the bronze players. Stacy's mom just carrying the bronzes right now. Actually unbelievable. Listen, gentlemen, you guys actually cannot ignore Ice Cold and Uzi in the chat. Uzi just ordered a huge tub of Jifu using Code Shock at checkout for 15% off and not an ad. Well, unfortunately, Uzi, you actually got 30% off there, not 15% off. My code is 30% off. Follow in Uzi's footsteps. In Ice Cold's footsteps. Grab some G Fuel. Use the link in the description. Use code SHOCK. Get 30% off. Outstanding deal. Aggressive peaks coming out from Noodle right now. No shots are going to land for either side just yet, though. That lion going to be a bit of a problem for the champ team. Just going to make them slow down a little bit. Not that big of a deal. Just a little bit of an annoyance. Looks like Noodle is actually locked into the player that is pushing Green Hall right now, I think. Noodle heard that, yeah. That's going to be Uzi with the first kill onto Zap. There goes that line I was talking about. Uzi just all the way outside right now. Wow. That's going to be Noodle with the first kill and the second kill for himself on this round. Uzi just trying to swing out into bunker. He's got these two players locked down outside. It's all at the best copper and Maddox in the 2v3. Can they pull it off? Nade's going to come out from best copper. Could be an easy kill onto Uzi, but the Nade's likely going to miss. Gonna waste his second aid as well. That might get the zombie trap, but that is about it. Uzi just sticking the outside peak. They currently have wall hacks on him. This really is a gunfight you cannot lose. Noodle might hop out the window. That's actually Josh might hop out the window. Not gonna happen though. Uzi with another kill. It is all up to best copper in the 1v3. And he win it. All three of the defenders are outside. He has wall hacks on every single defender right now. This should be the easiest clutch of his entire life. Pistol coming out. He needs to pull out the AR. He does not have the gun skill to take on these three champ players with just a pistol. Noodle coming upstairs. Probably going to get this kill. It's going to be Uzi with a flawless round. The champs take Oregon. 4-2. to two. Uzi with the 10k. GG's for the champ squad. Thank you so much to the bronze players for coming out and playing. And we are moving on to the silver game. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen. We finally have camps versus silvers. And the champs are going to be starting on defense this time, which is a first as the other two times they have started on attack. So we're going to switch it up a little bit just to uh, keep things fresh. So we're going to have the champ side start on defense and the silvers start on attack. All right, pretty solid lineup coming out from the silver players. We'll see what sort of push they're trying to do here. Spawn peaks are coming out from Uzi doing uh, a little bit of damage there onto the buck player but not enough to kill him uzi actually gonna run outside right now gonna get a nice headshot onto the buck very nice shots by uzi there but i'm gonna get taken out there uzi going for another kill right now onto the twitch player not quite gonna be able to get it just yet he's actually getting droned in so we're not we're starting to see the the silvers actually use some more coordination and drone each other in but it's not gonna matter uzi gets a kill on the chunky noodle runs out gets a kill onto luxes 
It is not looking good for the silver players already. Uzi sneaking in. Gonna take a lot of damage from the ace player on the study bow. This is an easy kill for ace. All he has to do is hit like one or two more shots onto Uzi. He's missing so hard. All he has to do is hit one or two shots. Remo gonna shoot through the window. No one can kill Uzi. He is exactly one HP. Remo finally gonna get gonna get a kill onto Noodle. That is going to be the Azami dead. Wow, what a shot by Uzi. That's going to be the Osa down. It's all up to the ace player now. Uzi just holding an angle onto the balcony. He could... Oh, no, he doesn't have impacts. So he could impact this. Uzi has 1 HP versus an AK, so he's got to be careful. Going to run out. Going to do a little bit of damage to Dorito, but not enough to kill him. It's all up to Ice Cold now, who's full HP, holding quite the pixel peak. Playing this fairly scared, considering the fact that he is against... Uh, an ace who has very low HP. He's gonna try to swing in now. Ice Cold just holding that pixel angle though. He's actually gonna whiff though. Ice Cold whiffs the shots. Both players whiffing now, but Ice Cold is gonna come out on top in the end of it all. Well played to the champ squad. A spawn peak already coming out from Uzi onto Remo. That is going to be the Osa player falling already. Another spawn peak coming out from Uzi. Going to get it as well. That's Chunky gone. That's the Finca player. Uzi going for a third onto the Nomad, but not going to happen. Luxus is going to down him. He's getting rezzed right in front of the window, though. This could be risky. Uzi with the triple kill already. Three of the silver players gone just like that. Noodle trying to get his own frag right here onto the habana he's actually gonna down habana now so it is just up to the zofia in the 3v1 ice cold's got a lock on his position right now just waiting for him to swing claymore's gonna go out really his best bet is to sit here and wait shots to the wall ice cold's gonna tag him up a little bit i'm not sure if noodle knows that he actually downed this guy he's gonna figure it out now though and he knows that they have the bomb Ice Cold's going to call out that the last person is on his position right now. Everyone's going to run over and try to kill him. Uzi going to hop at the window, and this is almost surely a kill for Uzi right here. Shots are going to miss. Wow, Raji actually with the kill there. Nice shots by him. Uzi was 1 HP to be fair, though. Noodle with the Azami shots outside, actually. Giving himself quite a lot of cover here. Zofia's son's going out. Ice Cold, where are you at? Help Noodle out here. Ice Cold going to try to push up to the window. This could be a great play for Ice Cold, but it's not going to matter because Noodle is going to get the headshot all the way outside behind his gates while stunned. Nice shots by Noodle and Uzi. Uzi's in a pretty good spot right now to get a bunch of spawn kills. He's going to see them on the cam, jump over the car. Going to see Nock. Going to do actually a little bit of damage. He's going to go for the repeak. A little bit more damage onto Nock, but that's going to be chunky. Getting the kill onto Uzi. Uzi saying he missed. He actually did indeed miss. Quite a bit of shots there. Doesn't matter though, as Ice Cold and Noodle are still alive in the 2v5 situation. We'll see if this is enough to clutch it out. Looks like they're going to try to push upstairs to master where Noodle is positioned. So we'll see how Noodle chooses to handle this. Chunky already into Pantry right now. Trying to hold Ice Cold. Remo's going to repel up. Noodle's in a pretty good spot right now. He can watch the pantry push in. And he's got head holes above laundry as well. He's got to be careful though. Wow, what a one tap by Noodle. Going for the second kill. An amazing shot onto the buck player outside Master. Really an incredible shot by him. Yings are going out right now. But it's not going to get anything. Noodle's already pushed all the way back into Solar. That's going to be Dorito getting a kill through the floor onto Ice Cold through Noodle's impact grenade hole, though. And that is also going to be Chunky taking the bomb site along with his two teammates. But Dorito has the bomb, and he's upstairs right now. Shots coming out from Noodle. Not going to land, and that's Chunky getting the kill. The 2v5, just not quite possible. And that is the champs going down. 1-2. All right, this is going to be the champs first round on attack here on Villa. And it looks like they're going to start it off with a bang as Noodle is going Amaru. Going to jump through the drone hole here into 90 hall. Most likely he's about to Amaru straight into this window. There's a lot of people by it though, so he's got to be careful. This could be huge for the champ squad or it could end up 
in a 2v5 for Ice Cold and Uzi. We'll see what happens. Amaru Gadget coming out. Doodle going straight in. Jaeger at the end of the hallway. He's going to take a lot of damage. Chunky getting the first kill onto Uzi. Dorito, 1 HP though. Just waiting for Doodle to swing. Where is Ice Cold at? Ice Cold on the study balcony. Going to take out Dorito. Nice shot by him. Noodle with another kill himself. Being put onto 1 HP though. The defenders definitely have the HP advantage, especially since they have that Thunderbird. Ice Cold trying to swing. Going to pop out a nade. Flashbang's going out. That's going to have the Capcan running away. Nade's going out. That's going to be Lux is getting taken out by the grenade. It's all up to Raji and Chunky now in the 2v2. Noodle is 1 HP, so the defenders definitely still have the advantage as we're going to see Noodle get taken out there. It is now a 1v2 for Ice Cold. Oh, the shots are being missed from Ice Cold. Absolutely awful execution by Ice Cold there. Ice Cold not on the case in this situation. Oh my goodness. Noodle repelling up to the Astro window here. Look at Noodle every single round. So this is how a smart player plays. Every single round, Noodle spawns in the right position to go exactly where he wants to push. And every round, he has a drone set up to play off of. This is exactly how you should be playing every single round. Noodle is leading by example right now. I believe we see Raji in the bathtub right now. That is interesting. Rito going to shoot the drone of... I think that was Ice Cold here. Who's he coming in through the bottom floor right now? In through Astro stairs, it looks like. Now, Ice Cold has to be careful here as Raji is in that bathtub. I don't think he knows. Captain going to swing now. Noodle maybe not expecting that as he didn't see him on the drone. Raji with the kill onto Uzi. That's the Finca going down. And that is Raji being downed. Refrag by Chunky. It's all up to Ice Cold. Ice Cold is just sitting on top of the balcony here. That's one Claymore kill for him. He has no idea how close he was to getting two kills if he had just aimed a little bit lower through that wall. Raji is only 20 HP and he's back in that bathtub. He's got to be careful of... He half chats, but it's not going to matter. Chunky with the kill. This is actually the silver players holding the lead right now. Can't even control the alibi recoil, but they are taking the lead over these three champ players. Already, we're seeing this be too difficult for the champs. Doing a little scoreboard check. We've got Chunky leading the team by far on the silver side, going six and one. I'm hearing some concerns from the, the champ side that maybe Raji and Chunky aren't silver. And they are the only two with kills. So I'll let the audience be the judge of that. They are both silver and they are both previously low ranks. And that's about the best I can get. If, if they have a history of being a low rank and they're currently the rank I need, there's not much more research I can do. So... In my findings, they are silver, but they could be Smurfs that Smurf into silver every season for some reason. Who knows? Lux is going for an aggressive castle barricade directly in front of Uzi, though. Could just be a gone six to open that up. We'll see what Uzi chooses to do about that. Doodle, Yana cloning all the way into laundry. No one shooting his clone somehow. That is very interesting. Capcom traps. They got to be careful of that. Uzi going to gone six that door or that window open. Memo is actually clear. Uzi's probably going to hop in on this. Finka boost going out. Uzi's going to hop straight into Memo right now. And it looks like he could have two kills lined up for him right now. That's the first kill onto Capkin. Gone. Castle is about to, about to follow up. Damage being put onto him. Ice Cold with another kill himself. Noodle trying to push into the bomb site as well. Got a three pronged push here into Laundry. Missed shots by Uzi, but it doesn't matter because Noodle's going to refrag. Nice shots by him. Rima with the flank, though. This is close, ladies and gentlemen. Ice Cold versus two. The defenders have the HP advantage, and Ice Cold has, has got to watch out for these Capcom traps. Chunky's playing inside a kitchen, and Remo is inside of Memo. Does Ice Cold know? He does. That's the first kill. 1v1. That's the Maestro getting taken out. Grenades coming out from Ice Cold onto Chunky. This is the top player for the Silver team. 7 and 1 right now for the Silver side. And Ice Cold clutch it out. If he loses this, the game is over. The video is over. Red Ping is going out on Ice Cold. They clearly have tons of info. And that's going to be Chunky 
winning it. 4-2-2. Two, two. Chunky going 8-1. and one. Maybe this guy's not a silver player. The guys on the other team don't think he is. From my findings, he is. I'll leave it up to the audience. You guys can decide. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. Thank you to everyone for playing. Remember to follow Ice Cold Noodle and Uzi with the links in the description. Follow me as well. I would appreciate it. Use code SHOCK to get 30% off your next G Fuel order. The links are all down below in the description. Thanks for watching. Give this video to 5k likes. Subscribe if you're new. Turn notifications on if you haven't. Have a great day.